Hello students, welcome to Teach You Smart. Let's continue our journey through exponents and powers. Today, we are going to learn how to express small numbers in its scientific form or standard form. In our daily life, sometimes we have to deal with small numbers. For example, the average diameter of a red blood cell is around 0.000007 meters, which is a very small number. Dealing with small numbers can be challenging as they are difficult to write and read. However, expressing these numbers in scientific form makes it much easier to work with them. Let's look at the example of the average diameter of a red blood cell. How do we express this in scientific form? The scientific form of 0.000007 is 7 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 6. This is in the form m multiplied by 10 raised to n, where m is a non-zero real number in absolute value, such that 1 less than or equal to m less than 10. And n is an integer that indicates the power of 10, by which the coefficient is multiplied. Let's see how these two forms are representing the same number. The given number is 0 0.000007. In order to find the scientific form of small numbers, we need to move the decimal point to the right of the first non-zero number. In this case, the non-zero number is 7. Let's do this step by step. When we move the decimal point, one place to the right, the new number, we get is 10 times larger than the original number. Hence in order to keep the value of the new number, the same as the original number, we need to divide the new number by 10, or multiply by 1 by 10. Repeat the process again, that is, move the decimal point one more place, to the right, we will multiply by 1 by 10, to keep the value the same as the original number. We continue this process until we move the decimal point to the right of the first non-zero number, 7. But we know that, that multiplying by 1 by 10 is the same as multiplying by 10 raised to minus 1. And 1 by 10 multiplied by 1 by 10 becomes 10 raised to minus 2. 1 by 10 multiplied by 1 by 10 multiplied by 1 by 10 becomes 10 raised to minus 3, and so on. Continue this process till we get 7 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 6, which is the scientific form of 0 0.000007. Here, 7 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 6 is in the form of m multiplied by 10 raised to n, where m equals 7, and n equals minus 6. Now we are going to discuss how to express a number in usual form if the power of 10 is a negative value. Let's check. Consider the number 7.54 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 4. This is in scientific form because it is in the form of m multiplied by 10 raised to n. Here, m equals 7.54 and n equals minus 4. 
We want to write it in usual form. We can write 7.54 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 4 as 7.54 divided by 10 raised to 4. That is equal to 7.54 divided by 10,000 equals 0 0.000754. That is, 0 0.000754 is the usual form of the number 7.54 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 4. Or, we can say that, in 7.54 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 4, the power of 10 is minus 4, which is negative. So, move the decimal point, four places left of a given number. That is, 1, 2, 3, 4. But there are no digits before 7. So any place that doesn't have a digit, fill it with zero. That is, 7.54 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 4 can be written in its usual form as 0 0.000754. Let's recall what we discussed today. Representing small numbers in scientific form and in the usual form. Before winding up, let's check how much you understood by doing an activity. Write the following numbers in scientific form. First, 0 0.000000564 Second, 0 0.000021 And write the following numbers in the usual form. First, 3.02 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 6. Second, 6.03 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 3. That's all for now, see you all in the next class.